A scout is trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and reverent. On my honor, I will do my best to do my duty to God and my country, to obey the scout law, to help other people at all times, to keep myself physically strong, mentally awake, and morally straight. My name is Carlos Luna. I'm Scoutmaster for Troop 550, Boy Scouts of America. It's important for uh, young men to grow up in, a, in an environment where they're given responsibilities, um, they're being taught to be good leaders, uh, they are being taught uh, survival skills. All those in uniforms, please salute. All those in the uniforms, please take the right hand with your heart. Ready? Begin. My name is Brian McCarthy. I joined the Boy Scouts when I finished sixth grade, so around the age of 13 or so. Uh, I joined because, well, I just finished Cub Scouts and I received my Arrow of Light, which is on my uniform right now. And uh, I, wanted, I wanted to continue because I had a fun time in Cub Scouts and I was ready to take it to the next level. My name is Kurt Jacobson. I am an assistant scoutmaster for the Troop 550 and I am also the Cub Master for Pack 550. Uh, watching these boys grow it is an amazing thing. I have two sons in the scouting. Uh, one is older and started straight in Boy Scouts. The other is a, a bear in the Cub Scouts. And, uh, and it's just uh, incredible watching them learn and grow to become independent. Well, I like camping. I like camping because there's like campfires and food, good food, occasionally. And then um, I like earning merit badges because they're fun and ranking up and all the, the scouts. It's fun doing waffle breakfasts. We, ha we have a waffle breakfast coming up tomorrow actually. Essentially what we do is uh, we set up a kitchen in, um, at a place at our local church mm. and we cook waffles and we sell them there. It, it gives a lot of insight into how uh, the restaurant business is run and it's a good fundraiser for our troop so that pays for all of our activities throughout the year. So this is one of our world famous Troop 550 waffles. I mean they've been better but this is pretty good as far as Troop 550 waffles go. <laughs> pretty proud of it. I am making waffles, the world famous waffles. Um, Boy Scout Troop 550. Here we have one waffle with strawberries. We're about to take it out to our customer. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Waffles today are so good. They are the best waffle I've ever tasted. The waffle was very good, uh, and the Boy Scouts did a great job. They were very attentive and quick to bring the waffle up. It's so good I can't stop eating. Say again? <laughs> <laughs> I like Boy Scouts because I get to see all my friends there. The camping trips are amazing. I've been to five or six summer camps so far. I've had a great time on every single one of them. We do a camping trip. We use the outdoors to teach uh, honor of the outdoors and respect for nature, but also respect for each other. It's a way to teach teamwork and independence. So I'm going to send you out someplace and say, go over there, cook. Create your habitat, cook, feed yourself, keep it clean, don't disturb it, and then pack up and leave. And so you have to you have to learn certain skills, use those skills, and then you teach each other on how to do it. Uh, I'm Matt Jacobson. Right now we are going on a camping trip.
rather nice. We have nice tobogganing times and hot dogs, so that's good. skills, um, uh, financial responsibility skills, uh, and you know, survival skills, swimming, all that stuff, and all those are merit badges that you earn, uh, and then once you earn all those merit badges and you, you learn, earn the basic skills and a lot of service hours, and, and it accumulates into the very, very last part of the Boy Scout, being a Boy Scout, and that is your, your Eagle Service uh, project. Well, today I uh, was helping on Jason Laguno's Eagle Project. We were painting a cabinet that we are going to fill with DVDs and give that to an elderly shelter. I'm working on my own Eagle Project right now. I'm interviewing veterans for the Library of Congress as part of the Veterans History Project. I've helped on countless Eagle Projects other than that. Basically, run a project uh, from, from start to end. You, you learn about responsibility, uh, managing people, people skills, uh, managing your finances. Uh, putting everything in, in a report, and then and then bringing all that together, and then submitting it to the council, and then they in turn will contact you, and they'll do a board review, and then they'll ask you specific questions. Um, you know, what kind of a person are you? Are you worthy of being an Eagle Scout? Um, and and uh, you know all these uh, other questions about you as a person, not so much you as a scout, but you as a person. Uh, what do you plan on doing for the rest of your life? Scouting helps them to learn how to accomplish things on their own, uh, in particular when they do service projects or work on their Eagle project or their merit badges. It's all on their own with a little bit of guidance from adults so that they can become better prepared. As an Eagle Scout, it helps them to get into college um, on their college application. Um, it's thought of and it's looked upon very highly to get them where they want to go. Uh, in regards to how Boy Scouts is going to help me in my life, I know that it's going to look good on college applications, which being a sophomore in high school, I'm going to have to start worrying about that in a bit. And the leadership skills and like the life skills I've learned here are going to come in, in, in handy immensely. More Additionally, like being prepared, the, the, the thing that the Boy, Scout teach, Boy Scouts teach you, being prepared is going to be a huge thing in my life. And uh, not to mention first aid skills, if someone ever gets hurt, I'm going to be there and be able to help them. So that's just a few things that are going to come in handy with Boy Scouts. I'm sure there's plenty more. Uh, the general purpose of Boy Scouts is to take young men and teach them citizenship and teach them how to become members of society in such a way that the, the goal or the aim of scouting is to teach boys to make moral and ethical decisions based on the 12 pillars of scouts. And that is the, that's the aim of scouting, is to teach you so that you're able to, as you go through life, your decisions and choices in life are based on the 12 pillars. Trustworthy, kind, courteous, obedient, thrifty, brave, all that kind of thing.